people think retirement planning is centered around growing their money, but that's not always the case. Well, our first guest this morning says you need to adjust your planning to encompass shifting goals. Welcome Jim Hefner. He's the president of Hefner Financial. He's a certified financial planner and is known as Carolina's retirement coach, and he joins us today. Hello, sir. How are you doing? Good morning. How are you? Doing great. This seems to be a disconnect between retirement planning and growing money. All right, help us understand the difference what that is, and I understand you have a really good analogy to go ahead and tell us. Well, well I hope so. We'll see. Yes. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, it's a great point. So, uh, my, here's my analogy. So, uh, I know you're a golfer, Eugene. Yes, right? I am, sir. Colin, I think anyone can get this. You'll probably get this for sure. you. You probably know as well. So, there's an analogy or, or an expression that says you drive for show and you putt for go. So, right? Exactly. And what that means is when you hit a long drive, you feel really good. Yes, you do. <laughs> you feel really good about it. But the money is made in the short game around the green, right? That's where it counts. So in, in, re, in financial planning, when you're young and growing your money, you want to go for that long drive. You want that growth, of course. But when you retire, you don't want to hit it far. You're now in the short game. You don't hit it far. You want to hit it accurately. Makes sense? Mm -hmm. Makes sense. Makes a lot of sense right there. So how critical is it for you to go ahead in your retirement planning to hit it accurately? Well, it is so important because, you know, growth planning is very forgiving. Because you have a long time, if you hook or slice a little bit and your lie is 30 feet off where you planned it to be. No big deal. Not a big It didn't cost you a stroke typically, right? But if you miss a putt by just a fraction of an inch, that's a stroke. So when you're, when you're young and growing money, you're in the accumulation stage of life. Yes. If the market's up or down at the moment, it doesn't really matter. It doesn't affect you that much in that moment, correct? Exactly right. Okay, right. So it makes sense. Yeah. But when you're retired and you're taking money out, if the market's down, that can be devastating. Mm -hmm. Unless there's a plan, that can be the killer. Okay, so you say that uh, growth is about your portfolio. Explain to us what do you mean by it's about your portfolio and growth? Well, so, so when, you're, when you're growing your money, uh, imagine that you're playing golf okay. with one club in your bag. That's all you got, and it's your driver. So if I have my driver only, yeah. I could, I'm missing all those short shots. I'm yeah. missing all the intermediate shots. You're knocking shots. the heck out of the ball, right? Yeah, I am, but, but... That's not what you want on most of your, your shots, right? Okay. So that's how much of America plays the game for retirement. They're always going for the long ball, always going for growth. Mm -hmm. But a good advisor is going to give you the tools for the short game, the, the irons, the wedge, the putter. Because now we need accuracy, right? Mm -hmm. It's not just about, it's not just good enough to make 10% a year. Because it's a paper gain, it doesn't really mean anything until you sell. Now accuracy really becomes very important. This totally makes sense. This is a great analogy, actually. Well, good. Yeah. I, I didn't mean to demean your golf knowledge. Oh, no, I you didn't at all. No, not one bit. It makes sense. Yeah. So why is it so difficult for us to go ahead and do what you're talk talking about? Because you're talking about being real specific with a wedge, with iron in your hand. You're yeah. talking about really specific specificity. So we need somebody like you to go ahead and help us navigate those waters. Well, unfortunately, Wall Street kind of sends the message to all of us that we need to go for growth. If we just get enough growth, everything's going to be fine. But we can run out of money. Well, that's right. I mean, the, the, the truth is, while that, that sounds good, the truth is that earning 20% a year won't be enough. If you're retired and you have now a down marketplace, you can't make enough to recover from that. Mm -hmm. So you have to have a plan when you retire. It's just that when there are, because if you're in the growth mode, you will have down markets, right? Yeah, so exactly. We have to have a way that we don't have to spend that money. We don't have to sell low and lock in. Also, we have to have another way to get by so that recovers. We can't go just for growth. We need the tools for a short game, because now when you're retirement, you are playing the short game. Well, Jim can help you with your short game. If you want to learn more about saving for retirement, call the team at Hefner Financial. The number is 704-552-1230. I'll say it again, 704-552-1230. And get this, the first five callers will receive a complimentary, no-obligation financial review. Again, 704-552-1230. One two three zero. You can also visit Jim's website. It's you'll just know dot com. You'll just know dot com. Jim Hefner, thank you so much. Indeed, Great job. thank you, sir. Good to see you. All right.